Okay, I just wanted to do some follow-up experiments with the uh, stubble field earth batteries. And um, before, when I did these experiments, I had a copper uh, piece of wire that I cut off and a uh, iron iron uh, welding rod. And uh, the very, let's take a look at this. The very tip of this guy technically doesn't have enamel on it. So, um, you know, let's let's actually get some enameled wire and we'll bend it. Actually, this whole wire is not enameled. So let's try some getting some enameled wire and we'll bend it so that uh, there's no conduction path. And we'll see if uh, we still get uh, voltage with having no conduction between this wire and that wire through the ground. No normal, no, uh, normal conduction. So I believe that psychotronic energy can conduct similar to electricity, but it, it is a very different thing. Some people might refer to it as cold electricity. Okay. Okay, anyway, resources seem to be scarce here. And so um, I happened to find this coil that I wound a long time ago out of enameled wire. And uh, it's just got the ends bare, buried. Uh, Oh, you see, uh, I've removed the enameling from the ends, and so let me um, just take our. Let's see, where's our clip lead? Okay, so we'll attach this to the the open end here, and this is similar to what Stubblefield was doing. Let's just dig a little hole in the ground, and we'll stick this into the ground and cover it up, like so. And this is right next to a tree here. And I will take this other wire and stick it in the ground over here. And if you look at that, even though the wire is completely enameled and we don't have any of the open ends touching the ground, I'll keep them away from the ground, we are still getting a voltage on the voltmeter. So there should be no current flowing through this, right? because the, the wire is completely insulated on the copper side and uh, we're still getting a, a voltage and since you know the, uh, the voltmeter is not infinite resistance that means there is a current flowing even though it's possible for impossible for a current to be flowing through this okay we'll take it out of the ground and the current stops okay very interesting huh so it does seem to imply. Look, I even set it on the ground and it produces a current, even though this is completely enameled, right? Completely enameled wire. There's no conduction path between there and let's, let's move it away from there completely. And the, uh, the iron rod that I have in the ground. And even when I set it on the ground, let's see, maybe I can set it different places. Oh, look, the voltage is higher if I set it over here. It's 0.09 volts, right? If I set it up here, it's 0.7. Set it over here, it's 0.7. Well, if I set it over there, maybe it doesn't have as good contact with the ground. It's lower. Okay, again, there is no, it's completely enameled. There's no conduction path on this. Alright? No conduction path at all. And uh, it's producing electricity as soon as I set it down. See that? Very interesting, huh? Anyway, this is uh, Dr. James, and thanks for watching.